Isaac, I can smell the contaminated air from here. It's spreading faster than I expected. I'm trying to isolate it, but it's not going to buy us much time. We have to get that thing off this ship. The chemicals you need are in the chemistry lab. I'll hack the door for you when you get there. You can't stand in the way of God's plan. The natural order. Are you... are you blind left to rest? Looks like someone has reprogrammed the door locks on this deck. And recently, too. I guess we're not alone here after all. Someone doesn't want you in this part of the ship. station. Once you get the chemicals, you're also going to need a DNA sample of the alien tissue. I'll search the records for one. Died out a long time ago. We 
just haven't accepted it yet. Stop running. Stop your struggle. Our future, your future, the future of our race ends here. Allow me to introduce you to humanity's child, the children that will replace us, our greatest creation. of the growth. According to lab records, there's an inert sample stored in the ICU. A Dr. Mercer was apparently doing intensive research on it. I've been trying to contact Hammond, but all I'm getting is static. Isaac, you've got to hurry. surprises me. Holding on to your final breath, you claw your way along. You hold on to what was once your war. But now, it belongs to the children. Be glad of the knowledge that your death will bring their birth. Listen. Can you hear it? It's coming. Say your prayers.
specimen continues to respond well to my experiments. Its cellular fortitude, not to mention elasticity, is remarkable. Dr. Kine, I'm sure, would disapprove. But I do not anticipate that issue as the good doctor is busying himself with the marker. As if that matters now. He has also succumbed to the same dementia that afflicted the colony. Only yesterday he told me he had spoken to his wife. But Amelia Kine has been dead for some years. <coughs> My subject grows restless. Patience. Your time is soon. Very soon. Adding to chemical compound. Final mixing required. That's it, Isaac. Now you just need to... This has gone far enough. Accept your part in the God's plan. Embrace your own extinction. Life support system failure on medical What the hell was that? Isaac, he's decompressed the entire deck and I'm being locked out of those systems. All the air has been vented into space. You should be able to bring it back online from the security station, but you don't have much time. Isaac. Now you just need to this has gone far enough. Accept your part in the God's plan. Embrace your own extinction. Life support system failure on medical. What the hell was that? Please evacuate immediately. Isaac, he's decompressed the entire deck, and I'm being locked out of those systems. All the air has been vented into space. You should be able to bring it back online from the security station, but you don't have much time. Isaac, now you just need to This has gone far enough. Accept your part in the God's plan. Embrace your own extinction. Life support system failure on that. What the hell was that? Please evacuate immediately. Isaac, he's decompressed the entire deck and I'm being locked out of those systems. All the air has been vented in space. You should be able to bring it back online from the security station, but you don't have much time.
everything you need to make the poison. Now get back to the chemistry lab. What are you going to do? Do it fast! Can I be breathing? You're cutting out, Hammond. I'm gonna try to switch over. Shit! I lost the signal. I'll continue scanning for his location. You have to get that compound mixed. Intel on the atmosphere. A survivor's report says a massive creature entered the hydroponic deck from outside the ship. That's when the air quality began degrading. The survivor called it the Leviathan. and get up to hydroponics as fast as you can. Still no response from Hammond, so be careful. There's no telling how contaminated that deck is. I'm beginning to truly admire your spirit, misplaced as it may be. I think... I think you should see the whole plan. You should not spurn the hive mind's offerings. You deserve to witness that, at least. Perhaps now you will understand. The work I have done must continue. Will continue. I, Dr. Charles Mercer, shall serve as the catalyst to the salvation of our species. These specimens will return to Earth with me. I will spread their divine glory across the entire planet. I will leave you with my creation. Embrace the inevitable. the last we see of that thing. I've managed to override Mercer's lockdown. There's a secondary tram station nearby and you can take it to hydroponics. Let's just hope there's enough time. <laughs> 